And similarly, so this is a cube, and this is a three-dimensional object. This is the net of a cube. So this is two-dimensional, and this is three-dimensional. And if folded properly, then this will become a cube. So this is a very typical example of the net of a cube. And if I fold it in this way, then this will become a cube in the end. So in the folding process, if this is the net of a cube and I fold it into a three-dimensional cube, so can you tell me that which will be the opposite phases of each other? Let's say this is phase number one and phase number three. If I fold it like this, then phase one and phase three will be opposite to each other. And again, five and six will be opposite to each other. And finally, phase number two and number four will be opposite to each other.